Hello, hello everyone, welcome to another episode. Today, I am going to be doing a cash card, the Cash App debit card unboxing and review. This arrived in the mail today, and uh, I was originally not going to do an unboxing or a review, but I'm like, well, you know, this isn't the, uh, I originally had a plastic cash card on a different account, and, you know, it arrived in like an envelope like you would expect a normal debit card to, but I'm like, hmm, this looks a lot more interesting, so we're going to go ahead and check it out. So, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Okay, so we go ahead and got this cash card right here. Let's go ahead and open it. Wow. Uh, okay, this is a lot nicer than I was expecting. Cash App X Visa. This, car's, this card was forged for, and then I'm not going to show it on camera, but it has my full name right there. That is really cool. Let's go ahead and open this up. Wow. Okay, so uh, <laughs> this is a lot fancier than last time. So I want to say real quick, we got this QR code. I want to say real quick, um, I got the metal cash card um, for, you know, and you may be like, well, why did you spend $50 on a cash app debit card? Well, it's because uh, I'm going to talk about it a little bit later in the video, but um, I was having a lot of trouble getting the card, but every so often I would like fake sign up, right? And I'd be like, oh boy, I'm going to get the metal card. And uh, I did it, and I wasn't, I was just like mindlessly going through and didn't realize it actually was allowing me to purchase it. So I ended up purchasing this. But the presentation on this, very nice. Very nice black metal. Let's go ahead and do a drop test. It sounds sort of like the Apple card, if any of you have that. It makes sort of a sound. That's very nice. I'm going to go ahead and privately look at the back real quick. Very nice engraving. This is definitely the nicest debit card I own by far. And of course, the nice slick black, just just plain black thing. I didn't customize it at all. Didn't put my cash app tag on it. Just black. You have this little slit right here. I don't know why they do that. I would have gotten rid of that if I could. And then of course, the cash app logo on there. But this is one of the nicest debit cards I own. It actually rivals, I have it right here, the crypto dot com card i mean it doesn't really matter if you see my details this card i don't use it anymore but uh yeah very very nice card as well let's go ahead and do a drop test on that let me go ahead and make sure the name is covered hopefully i mean it does actually it doesn't really matter oops so that's the crypto.com card and then that's the cash app card cash app card definitely sounds a lot better but let's go ahead and get into my review of the card Okay, so, uh, real quick, I do want to say this is by far the nicest case. I, I'm going to be keeping this case. This case is freaking awesome. Like, honestly, this would just be good to, like, put another debit card in. Like, it looks so cool. I really, really love this presentation. So, this is, if you purchase the $50 metal debit card, uh, you know, um, you get the metal debit card, of course, and you get to this absolutely amazing case right here, which I really, really love. Not that you're going to be carrying around a single debit card in this, but, you know, I do really, really like the look and presentation of this. But, let's go ahead and get into the Cash App card itself. So, if you didn't know already, Cash App card, anybody can get one, including those under the age of 18, which is, you know, nice. Usually people under the age of 18 can't get it. Um, so, you know, that's cool. But it also gives boosts, which gives you a percentage off of usually a specific location or type of location. Currently, I have the 10% back in Bitcoin at any restaurant, which is actually a really good deal. I've used that a couple of times and I really enjoy it. You know, I don't think this card is actually terrible. I really, really love it. And of course, I really, really love the metal feel and look of this debit card. Like I said, definitely the nicest debit card I've owned. However, um, I turned 18 uh, three, three, three and a half months ago. And my first goal was to transfer away from my parents' account and get my own cash app debit card, like this one. So I go ahead and contact support, cancel my current debit card. And they're like, okay, just sign up for a new one. So I'm like, okay, give them my personal details, sign up for it. And they're, it says, Hey, something isn't correct. I'm like, uh, okay, try again. Hey, something isn't correct. I'm like, Hey, support, can you help me with this? Um, and they're like, okay, just put your driver's license, proof of identity in this link, and we'll go ahead and sort it out for you within 10 businesses, which first of all is ridiculous. Most places can instantly verify your identity with a driver's license, just using AI. I'm like for other companies, I've never had it take more than an hour. 10 businesses is absolutely ridiculous. 
So, I wait the 10 businesses. Nothing happened. Try and sign up for the cash card again. Nothing happened. Go back to support. And they're like, oh, uh, yeah, we didn't get your information. I'm sorry, what? You didn't get my information? So I'm like, okay. I try again. And go through the same process again. And they didn't get my information. And I go through this four times. After the third time, I created another account and tried again to see if that was the issue. Nope. So, you know, I'm stuck with this. And then I go in the sixth time and I'm like, I'm going to explain why this is ridiculous, okay? And I'm like, hey, um, I can't verify my information. And I'm like, this is absolutely ridiculous. Here's what's going to happen because it's happened every single time, blah, blah, blah. And they're just like, okay, verify your information here. And I'm like, you didn't acknowledge the second part of the gigantic paragraph I sent you. Let's try again. So I say, hey, why didn't you acknowledge the second part of my paragraph? And they're just like, oh, here's how you verify your information. So that's a little suspicious. So I'm like... Hey, uh, what's the biggest war going on right now? Just answer that question. Hey, here's how you verify your information. Uh, okay. So, I think they're using AI to respond to messages, which is weird because they're not online 24-7. But I can't think of another explanation for why they just wouldn't acknowledge my questions, except for here's how you verify your information. And after the sixth time of verifying my information, maybe like three days later, I went ahead, entered it again, and I got this cash card, which, again, this is absolutely amazing. I love the look. I love the feel. I love this freaking case. Like, it's not worth $50. I didn't get anything. I didn't get, like, bonus rewards. I didn't get anything. I just got a metal debit card and a case. This is cool, though. I'm going to be honest. Uh, like, it's not not worth the $50. I, you know, if metal debit cards are your thing and you have $50 to waste, why not, you know? But, like, cash up support, man, it is hot garbage. Like, it took three months to get this card. It should have taken 24 hours, maximum. I should have signed up. It said, we didn't verify it with just your social security number. I should have been able to just, it should have, like, recommended, hey, just submit your driver's license here. Because guess what? After I signed up for the cash card, I went to Bitcoin. So I could enable Bitcoin transfers. So I could transfer out any Bitcoin I got from my cash app purchases. And it's like, hey, here, you need to enter your driver's license again, just so we can double verify. And I did that, and it was verified within, like, 60 seconds. Why isn't that the procedure for the cash card? It would have been so much easier. I should have had this three months ago. But no, it took three months to get my hands on this because support just kept deflecting and deflecting and doing the same thing over and over and over again. And I had to wait 10 businesses before contacting them. It was such an awful experience. Cash App support is by far the worst support I have ever interacted with. Because, again, I still think they're not real. It's just so mind-bogglingly awful as far as support goes. I wouldn't recommend using this to anyone just for the support alone. Like, if you do get this cash card, you know, don't keep a lot of money in Cash App. Because if it disappears, you're kind of screwed. You know, I wouldn't expect support to help you out. But, um... Yeah, you know, it is a decent debit card. Like I said, I love the presentation and the feel of the metal card. But plastic card, you get the same boosts, same rewards, and it's just as good. You get the virtual card, you get, you can customize the card. I didn't go over this because I didn't customize it, but you could put whatever you want on here. By default, it has your cash uh, tag right here. And, you know, if you want to customize it, you can. Uh, but yeah, so... That is my review of the Cash App debit card and just my general experience with Cash App. And I'd like to say again, this case is freaking awesome. Is it worth $50? Not really, but I, I've never had an experience like opening this to see my Cash App. And, you know, just for the funsies, I'll go ahead and activate my Cash App card on stream, or not stream, video real quick, just to make sure it works. You know, it would be very haha -ha funny if it didn't let me verify my Cash App card or activate it but um i gotta say this is by far the best presentation they make sure you get your 50 dollars worth i gotta say and you know uh, i'm not sure what material this is made out of it's a bit heavier than the crypto.com card cash card activated withdraw cash anywhere add it to google play use your card anywhere absolutely love it but cash app support man it's so god awful i don't know if i could recommend using it oh and one more thing really quick I load this with my Yada debit card, I get rewards. So I can get rewards on top of my rewards, just like with my Crypto.com card. But that will be all. If you enjoyed, please like and subscribe. Channel membership down below gives you early access to ad-free versions of all of my videos. And uh, yeah, that'll be it. Thank you for watching.
Peace out.